The Senate moved closer to passing a $95.3 billion foreign aid bill over the weekend, with key provisions for Ukraine and Israel. Despite progress, GOP Senator Rand Paul's efforts have slowed the process, potentially delaying a final vote by days. Although the chamber reached a critical 60-vote threshold to advance the bill on Thursday and conducted further procedural votes on Friday, an agreement among all 100 senators to expedite proceedings has not been reached. As a result, the Senate is expected to continue its weekend session, with a final vote likely to occur sometime during the upcoming week. Should the Senate pass the bill, it would then move to the House, where Speaker Mike Johnson's stance on scheduling a vote remains uncertain, given opposition from many House Republicans regarding additional aid to Ukraine. The timing of Sunday's vote coincides with the lead-up to the Super Bowl. Majority Leader Chuck Schumer has made preparations for the possibility of the Senate being in session during the game, setting up a room adjacent to the Senate floor equipped with tables and televisions. Schumer expressed determination to continue working on the bill until completion, acknowledging the unusual circumstance of the Senate convening on Super Bowl Sunday. Democratic Senator Chris Murphy expressed optimism about the bill's passage, foreseeing approval by early to midweek.